What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Second Accord and I just want to do a quick video. Um, there was an update to the Universe ROM. Um, the last version was 2.3. Um, this version is 3.0. So there were some pretty significant changes so I went ahead and going to do a quick video. I'm not going to go over everything. I'm just pretty much going to quickly run over some of, some of the changes. Um, one change I did notice is that the lock screen is now the stock touch with lock screen which I actually like this lock screen anyway so to me it's pretty cool so now I have my weather on the lock screen I don't know if you can see it uh, the camera's kind of bright but um, like I have the cam I have my weather and have a down here <clears throat> um, visually not a whole lot's changed is the theming is pretty much exactly exactly the same um, it has it does, has changed some of the apps so that's pretty cool. Um, first thing is if you go to the dialer, the dialer is now themed. Um, it's a really cool theme. I really like this dialer. It functionally it is exactly the same as the touch with dialer. So if you start dialing numbers, you'll see uh, you know it'll try to predict what contact that, that that you know that you're trying to dial. So that hasn't changed at all. But it's a cool theme. Um, messaging app. So far, it's exactly the same. I haven't really noticed any difference in there. Um, the music player is now the Samsung Galaxy S3 music player. So you have this cool music square where you can pick a. It'll scan all of your music, and you can pick a uh, an emotion. And it'll play music based on that emotion. So it's really cool. It's a really good way to listen to music in a different order in different ways kind of like a shuffle but it kind of picks similar feeling music I guess it's decent so you have these cool things at the top another thing that has changed is the alarm clock the clock application now is now the, the S3 alarm so so it's really really cool so that's awesome um, the clock application is still exactly the same, so no, so no change there. Um, something else is cool is the YouTube app. I mean, sorry, your Gmail app is now the updated latest version. So now you can pinch and zoom in your Gmail app. So that's awesome. Another thing is the. Keyboard is now the 4.2 um, stock Google keyboard, so you can either, you know, type normally, or or you can um, now you can use swipe features, and it'll try to predict the word as you're swiping. And you just let go, and it'll. Just awesome. Um, the Google application, the Google search application, has been updated too. So you still have the Google Now, but the Google Now is themed, so it has um, it's inverted. So I'll show you that. What's the weather like today? Today's forecast for Omaha is 66 degrees with a chance of shower. So there you go. So it's cool. If you swipe down, it's still going to be your white. But uh, it's just really cool that uh, it's themed now. Um, another difference is the CPU sleeper app that used to be on there is no longer there. So I don't know if uh, why they took took that out. But um, potentially, um, you still have the awesome beats in here so I don't think there's any difference there um, better Wi-Fi is still there um, besides that everything else seems seems the same you still have the Galaxy Note gallery so it's still the note, note from the Galaxy uh, Galaxy Note um, besides that I really haven't noticed any any other differences in the ROM um, 
battery life, I it, I can't test the battery life yet because you know I just downloaded this earlier today. I haven't even cycled it, cycled it yet. So, um, besides that, to download this, you are going to um, you do not have to wipe your data. So if you go on the website, go on where you find the universe uh, ROM on XX on XDA. They do have a format, um, a format zip that you can do, and there's two different ones. There's a format all that will wipe your data, and there's a format that won't wipe your data. All I have to do is run the format, zip, uh, the format zip, and then flash the ROM. You know, it'll update your applications, and then it'll just download everything. So. But uh, it's 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 running good, no issues so far. Um, another thing that they took out, and I don't know if it's done on purpose or not, but um, they used to have a reboot menu. So when you went to restart, you had different options, but those options are no longer there anymore. So that's one thing that's that, that kind of sucks. But uh, I mean, you can still get to it, your recovery by holding the power and the volume up. Um, and one other thing too is the recovery has changed. It is now on using the AGAT re, uh, recovery. So I mean it's just it's a minor minor difference. So you're not going to notice it too much. And the animation, I do believe, I'm not exactly sure the animation, but the animation has changed to uh, power up your device. But I haven't noticed any difference. Um, it still runs exactly the same, and I'm gonna show you guys the recovery. Just oops. So yeah, so you're in AGAT re recovery instead of uh, the Blue Cuban recovery from before, and. I'll show you guys the boot up. So there we go. If you have any questions, uh, just leave a comment below. If you liked this video, please give me a thumbs up. Um, go ahead and check out my channel. Check out my other videos. If you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe. It's Second Accord. I'm out.